How's it going, guys? My name is DJP. Welcome back to another MLB The Show 24 franchise video today. We're doing another fantasy draft. We're going to have Legends fantasy draft. Doing Legends today. We're going to have them in the fantasy draft to be able to pick them up. Uh, basically, they're the non-active free agents. Um, so we're going to be putting them into the game. We're going to see what happens. It should be fun. Leave like, subscribe, and join the content. Comment down below some more videos. We're on socials. Play the second channel and main channel down below in the description if you like the content from me, TJP. Uh, with that being said, let's uh, get on with the game plan. I'm not sure how many seasons we're going to do. Injuries are off. We might do four or five. Depends on how, uh, how I'm feeling. So, we're on the game. All right, so I'm just going to pick a random team. So, I'm going to stop in uh, 3, 2, 1. Then we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And we're going to be using the St. Louis Cardinals. Beautiful. So, we're going to go Jim Conscious off, Fancy Jeff on, allow non-active free agents. So, this will be uh, any uh, player from various leagues. This includes Legends. We're going to try to get as many Legends as we can on the team. Uh, not sure any picks I'll draft. Maybe I'll do 15. We'll see. But I definitely want to get, you know, some Legends on the squad. So, that's obviously the priority when it comes to drafting. So, here we go. Where we got? We have... The 17th pick. Okay. So we're going to advance to it and see what happens. So Hank Aaron went number one. <laughs> okay. All right. So for some legends here, um, a lot of good players. A lot of good players. Do I try to get a good pitcher? Um, it's a lot of 99s. Andy Pettit would be interesting. We got Burt. No, I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with the cover athlete's father, real Vladimir Guerrero. I'm gonna go with him. I don't know why. I just feel like I want to draft Vladimir Guerrero. So we're gonna take him first. All right, next I'm taking Greg Maddox. Uh, gonna get myself a really good pitcher. So Greg Maddox, welcome to the squad. I'm gonna go with Derek Jeter, the captain. Get him from our team. I'm gonna grab another 99 overall. We're gonna go with uh. Hmm. I'm going to go with Adrian Beltre. Get ourselves a third baseman, hot corner. Adrian Beltre. I'm going to get another pitch here. I'm going to go with Jim Palmer. Uh, we're going to add him to our rotation. He'll be our fifth pick. Right, I'm going to get myself a first baseman. I'm going to go with Carlos Delgado for the squad. I need myself a catcher, so we're going to go with Josh Gibson. Should be a nice pick up there for us from the Negro Leagues. All right, I'm going to get uh, Garrett Cole. Uh, not sure why he says he's a relief pitcher, but we're going to go with him anyway. I'm going to grab another starting pitcher, Al Leiter. Coming to our team. Welcome team, Al Leiter. All right, I'm going to take a young Mark McGuire here for our team. I feel like that'd be an interesting pickup for us. We can kind of develop into something pretty good. All right, I'm going to grab John Smoltz uh, to add to, I guess, I mean, I guess he's the bullpen, but I mean, honestly, he's a starting pitcher to me. I'm going to get myself Greg Vaughn, left fielder, little legend left fielder, Greg Vaughn. Welcome to the team. All right, for my center fielder, I'm going to go with Mike Cameron. Uh, legend Mike Cameron. Uh, I'm going to do one more pick after this for the Legends and I'll let the CPU draft the rest of the team. I fall. Actually, I got two more picks. I'm going to do Jerry Harrison Jr., get us to a second base legend. And then to close it off, we're going to get Rob Nen, closing pitcher. I think we have every position, at least one legend, so that's perfect. So we're going to accept the closing pitcher and then let the CPU draft the rest of the team. So here we go. Let's see what happens. And... Um, We'll go on from there. All right, so as I mentioned before, injuries are off, but look at the team. We're ranked number one, 25th in contact, ninth in power, third in pitching, first in defense, and 13th in speed. And you can't see that because my f head is blocking, but rest assured, that's what it says. So I'm um, seeing who else we got. We got ourselves an Arcia, a brand jury. So he, ironically, uh, Jerry Harrison Jr. is a legend, but he is in the minors. Um, it's unfortunate, I guess, but... What are you going to do? Beltre, Jeter, Guerrero, Delgado. We got Orlando Garcia, Josh Gibson, Greg Vaughn, Brain Drury, and then Mike Cameron. We got Bettencourt, McGuire coming off the bench with Grisham, Brock Jones. Okay. The rotation is going to be interesting. Maddox, Palmer, Al Leiter with Wells and Walker Bueller. Garrett Cole and John Smith side the bowl with Carlo Jr., Tyler Madzek, Nancy Almonte, Hunter Harvey, Taylor Rogers, and then Rob Nen. 
Not too bad. Honestly, not too bad. Uh, of course, we'll make some trades at some point. Um, just not sure when. Uh, everybody's on a one-year contract, so that's going to be fun trying to re-sign everybody. Um, Andrew McCutcheon is on like a crazy... I wonder who the hardest player would be to trade for here. I have no idea. It's tough to say. I probably should turn off budget. Because it's going to be hard to sign people, but, you know, it's all good. All right, let's see what happens here. I'm going to simulate a little bit, and uh, we'll go to the all-star break, and then if I want to make some moves, then I will. I'm going to keep the team as is for now. Let's see what happens. We're not a good baseball team. They said first overall ranking. Yeah, okay. We're 39-58. That's absolutely terrible. Um, I mean, Belcher's having a solid year. Jeter's been brutal. Uh, Greer's having a nice year. Delgado. Mark McGuire, yikes. 189 average. What are we doing here, man? Uh, Arcia's been really good. All right. Vaughn. Mm, Gibson's been solid. Mike Cameron. Moradia. Drury's been amazing, pretty good. And the bench has been pretty lackluster other than that. The pitching rotation. I mean, Maddox has been awesome. Jim Palmer's been absolutely abysmal. Al Leiter's been absolutely abysmal. Tyler Wells. And Walker Buehler has been bad. Oh, my goodness. The pitching. Oh my gosh, yikes, it's terrible. Okay. Well, we got a lot of lot of trades then to make, so. And a lot of free agent signings that we need to do as well. Uh, because we are way over budget. I mean, obviously, makes sense. I don't know why they have Andrew Benatendi on the team. I mean, we're going to move him, I think. I mean, he's, I mean, he's obviously pretty solid, but he's just way too much money and he's not going to play, so. I'll try to see if I can get a different player. I'm going to do see what the Pirates can get. Mark Pryor for Ben Attendi, Grisham, and Yancey Almonte. Uh, I feel like that's going to hopefully help our bullpen out a little bit. <laughs> Just get some more pitching. Uh, I'm going to do a steal here with the Tigers. Going to get Ian Kinsler for Caratini, Braden Schumach, uh, and Taylor Rogers. So, Ian Kinsler, welcome to the squad. I mean, it's not going to make the team that much better um, for this season. Um, because we're obviously not even going to make the postseason. We're one of the worst teams in the MLB. But... Hopefully next year will be better because uh, this year is obviously a wash. All right, 78-84, obviously not good enough to make the postseason. But yeah, pretty disappointing season. I mean, we look at the stats here, though. I mean, Bellatrix was solid. Jeter, good power numbers, but the average is surprisingly low at 260-57. I'd like it to be a little bit higher than that, I'm being honest with you. Um, Guerrero was good. Delgado, solid. Garcia was good. Kai, I mean... Drury off the bench was nice. I like the way he played. Brock Jones had 56 back. Mark McGuire, though, I'm kind of surprised. Was not as good as I wanted him to be. Or was anticipating him to be. Uh, but there's time. Maddox, shutouts, and all that fun stuff. Okay, Posada hit 331. Good for you, Jorge. And then Duke Schneider. Okay. 55 home runs. He was a monster. All right. Pitching rotation, Maddox was good, Palmer sucked, Alida wasn't great. Yeah, we got to improve the pitching for sure. The bullpen, Hunter Harvey was decent, Nen, terrible. Mark Pryor was a good pickup for us, so I like that. And being our closer too, it's kind of funny. So we've got the Athletics beating the Giants in the World Series Battle of the Bay. All right, so on the offseason. All right, so I did my arbitrate, uh, well, I did my... Uh, my exclusive contracts. I'm curious to see free agency. That's kind of what's important. Um, obviously, adding talent to the team is important. Um, a lot of my guys are obviously free agents. We're trying to get skim guys back. Also, try to add some more talent. Uh, Cy Young would be cool. We'll throw him a little cheeky deal. And again, I might do the cheese. I have to do the cheese. Where I offer low money but high years and see if we can get these guys on the squad. Because the more talent we have, the better we'll be. Hopefully. That's uh, the objective. So we'll see what happens. Try to get him on the squad. I don't know if he'll, that'll work. But but yeah, we're just going to try to get most of these guys back on the team. And then um, I think uh, Andy Pettit might be a little too expensive. But yeah, I also try to try to add uh, 
more people to the squad. That's really what it comes down to. All right, so we got Babe Ruth. I lost Greg Maddox. There's going to be a lot of guys moving it back and forth, which is fine. Um, it's all about just trying to figure out who we can add to the team. Also got ourselves Cy Young, which is nice. All right, I grabbed Ken Griffey Jr. I like that pickup for us. All right, I got Johnny Bench catcher so i like that uh i like that for us so johnny bench and josh gibson potentially i got chase utley i don't know if you guys saw that but i might have went a little too fast but i got a uh, chase utley so i'm happy with that um are we out of money we're not i kind of want to get stan usual on this team if i can try to get another first baseman or todd helton um i don't know if i can afford stan i'm gonna try uh no nah, probably not todd helton Nah, you're not going to accept that. Uh, what first baseman do we have out there we can get? Justin Moore? No. Maybe. Nah, probably not, though. Eddie Murray? Yeah, we'll go Eddie Murray, then. He should be probably, uh, relatively inexpensive, so we'll throw him a little, little deal here and should be able to get him. All right, I actually couldn't get Eddie Murray ran out of money, but we improved our team, I think. Uh... I mean, our team looks pretty good. Oh, yeah. Well, we have also Delgado, so it's fine. Yeah, Vladimir Guerrero, Jared Jeter, Babe Ruth. Uh, the original Shohei Ohtani. Okay, Griffey Jr., Carlos Delgado, Edgen Belcher, Chase Utley, Johnny Bench, and Greg Vaughn. We got Drury, Betancourt, McGuire, and Arcia coming off the bench, as well as Mike Cameron and Ian Kinsler. Not sure if all of them are going to be there, but the rotation of Babe Ruth, Cy Young, Jim Palmer, pretty nice. And we got Wells and Bueller. Garrett Cole, John Smalls, Chris Bassett, Hunter Harvey, Carl Edwards Jr. I don't remember having Chris Bassett on my team, but I guess he's on my team. Rob Nen, and then Mark Pryor. I might move Chris Bassett. I might want to try to get another starting pitcher, honestly. Um, Carl Rodon's on my team? Yeah, no, that's impossible. <laughs> I want neither of those players on my team. Uh, way too big on the budget. So, let's see if we can maybe get myself somebody better. A lot of second basemen. I'm going to throw... I'll throw Jerry. Uh, I'll throw... Uh, throw... I don't know who I throw in there. Hmm. Fernandez might have some value. He's, got, he's a young guy, so... All right, let's see. Can I get myself a better starting pitcher? Yamamoto. That's kind of cool. Can't get Pedro Martinez. Can't get Brandon Webb. Leon Day can't get. CC. These guys are on. I, I don't even know who's on like a one-year deal or not. So that's going to be difficult to figure out. Okay, Cliff Lee. Yep. All these guys are probably on these deals. And you padded Catfish Hunter. Yeah, I don't think I could trade for a, like a legend. I think these guys are all like not gonna work. It, normal Garakul. And now it's not gonna work. Hmm. Joe Ryan and Reed Detmers. I can get jo just Joe Ryan. Reed Detmers. Hmm. Shane McClanahan. Can I get him? Nope. Nope. Can't get any of these guys. Drew Rasmussen, can't get. Greg Maddox, Phil Negro, Nolan Ryan, nope. Normal Logan Webb, can't get. Randy Johnson, I'm not going to be able to get. Okay, I, I'm just trying to figure out who I want to get on my team here. Um, so I guess, okay, Yamamoto, Tanner, and, and, and Tanner Hawk. I'll go with that, I guess. Why not with the Orioles? All right, that's it for me. Let's head on to the uh, All-Star break, and I'll see you guys once I'm there. All-Star right, all break, 65 and 33. We are better. With the trading block here, a lot of guys on there. Todd Helton. Ooh, beautiful. So if we look at the lineups, we got uh, Rare Jr. not doing too bad. Jeter having a better year. Babe Ruth's been amazing. At the dish, at least. We got to see how he's pitching. Griffey Jr. has been solid. Delgado's been good. So I like the way we've been playing here. Greg Vaughn's been a nice year. Drury, uh, the bench has been kind of iffy. I mean, <laughs> Mark McGuire's only had 14 of assets here. Uh, 357, though, and then Mike Cameron's been decent. Okay. 
Kinsler. The rotation, Babe Ruth. Eh, it could be pitching better. Cy Young's been absolutely insane. Okay. Jim Palmer's been good this year. Yeah, Moto on fire, but yeah, not, not incredible. The bullpen, eh, Bueller's in the bullpen. He's doing well. Hunter Harvey. Nen's been bad. Edwards has been really good. And Mark Pryor has been good. 25 saves. Uh, we're the best team in the MLB. Yep, 65 wins. I mean, there's really no need to make trades. We're just going to keep the team as is. And All right, 107 and 55. Won the division. Taking on the winner of the wildcard playoff game. And, um, yeah, that's the best record in the MLB right there. Best in the NL and also best in the MLB league leaders. Babe Ruth, 65 home runs, 157 RBIs, 22 hits, 138 runs, 696 slugging, and an OBPS of 1.095. That's impressive if I've ever seen it myself. I mean, that is great to see. So, awards, we have a Babe Ruth, Hank Aaron, and MVP. I mean, no surprise there. Um, wow. Okay. Well, we look at the lineups. I mean, obviously, Guerrero Jr. was good. Derek Jeter, 30 home runs. That's a career high. Babe Ruth has 65 home runs. And he pitched really well, too. So, shout out to Babe Ruth. Delgado was good. King Ruby Jr. nice year. Beltre, Johnny Bench, Chase Utley was okay. And then uh, Greg Vaughn, good as well. The bench, McGuire, 39 at bats, not too many. I mean, the bench wasn't amazing, but it's fine. So, yeah, ba Babe Ruth, great second half of the year pitching. That glove is gigantic. Jim Palmer, Cy Young was superb. Okay, I like the team. I do like the team. Bullpen scary a little bit. Mark Pryor, how many saves? 42. Very good. We're taking on the Brewers. Standings, 97 win teams. We're 10 games better than them. We got Babe Ruth. They got Corbin Burns. Game one. We win 8 to 3. Good job from Babe Ruth. Game two, Palmer versus Maddox. Former pitcher. We beat him. Shout out to Jim Palmer going the entire distance. Can we win game three here? Cy Young versus Phil Necro. We can. We lose three to two, unfortunately. Game four, yeah. Moto versus Braxton Garrett. We win two to one. Let's go. So in the NLCS, we got the Nationals. They won 91 games. Babe Ruth, Joe Ryan, game one. We win six to one. Shout out to Babe Ruth. It's been really good so far. Game two, Cy Young versus Reed Detmers. Win that one six to three. Can we win game three? Palmer versus Sandoval. We don't. Jim Palmer got uh, the loss. Game four, Yamamoto versus Joe Ryan. We win six to five, and let's try to win in five. Tanner versus Dean Kramer. We do just that. Into the World Series we go, and we got the Blue Jays. The Jays who are blue. 88 win team. So we've got Babe Ruth. They've got CC Sabathia. Game one. We win that one 14 to 13, a slugging fest. Game two, Palmer versus Williams. We win five to three. Can we win game three here? Cy Young versus Logan Allen. We don't lose four to three. Was it in uh, extras? No. Okay. Game four, Yamamoto versus Sabathia. We lose again. Can we please not lose three straight? Ruth versus Assad. And we don't. We're going to a game six. Let's hop on in. Play the game. A little quick manage action see what happens. We got a 3-2 lead. We're at Bush Stadium. Let's try to win in front of our home fans. Jim Palmer on the mound for us. Let's see how we do. I got Gavin Williams. Let's just hit the ball a little bit. Top second, nothing. Bottom two. Got a run. Palmer gave a solo home run after getting run support. Gives up another run. Top five, nothing. Bottom five, nothing. Top six, nothing. Bottom six, Nothing. Okay. Still nothing. And now we're down 4-1. So, Jim Palmer, we're going to take you out. Put in John Smoltz, top nine. Ground out, fly out, double. And we're going to lose the game. Johnny Bench, ground out. Chase Utley, strike out. Greg Vaughn. And we lose. Not good offensively whatsoever, but it is what it is. Well, we got to win game seven now. Play game. 
Let's try as a blow. I mean, I, I like to not blow a 2-0 lead and a 3-2 lead, but, you know, this would be a very San Diego Studios ending. Wouldn't be surprised. All right, let's see what happens here. Cy Young already giving up a run. All right, we got to run back, though, 1-1. Okay, almost gave him another run. Top three. Okay, good. Bottom three. Nothing. Top four. Nothing. Bottom four. Got a little two-run home run. Three to one. Got a little run support. And we're, again, we get run support, give up the runs right away. I love it. I, that's, I just love it. Okay, six to three. Let's not choke. Line out. Single. Single. We're choking. Double play. Let's go. Okay, Cy Young is done. <laughs> Bottom six. Strikeout. Solo home run, Greg. Okay, now we're up 17. Now I'm happy. This is this is good. Okay. We're going to take Cy Young out. Let's put in... I'm freaking out. Mark Pryor. Ground out. Ground out. There we go. Fly out. Ground out. Fly out. All right, top eight. Strike out. Single. Okay. Get out of here. Double. Ground out. Embarrassing. Pathetic and putrid. Okay. Yeah, our pitching is brutal, man. Oh, my God. What are we doing? Fly out. Double. We're hopping on in. We're hopping on in. We're hopping on in. Come on. Let's not choke. Please. All right. Uh, I mean, trying not to choke here. One out. Runner on second. Let's see what happens. Here's the pitch. Chase Utley takes it for a ball. Uh, I mean, we're tied, so it's just the problem is our pitching has been absolutely embarrassing um, this game. Run support. It's just we get run support. We blow a four-run lead. It's just not good. So I guess we have to score like 120 runs or something. I mean, now we're swinging at balls in the dirt, so this is uh, not looking too good. We don't seem disciplined. Okay. Two balls, two strikes. We got to be disciplined. All right. Here we go. Two balls, two strikes. Okay. Good. A little Greg Vaughn action. He's got a home run single tonight. It's only hitting 200 with the runners in scoring position. Let's just try to work a walk, potentially get on base. Let's not swing at garbage. Okay, that's perfect. That's perfect, Chase Utley. Little RBI double action. Let's go. Clutch up, Chase. Clutch up. That's what we like to see. That is what we like to see. That is Chase Utley, ladies and gentlemen. That is Chase Utley, ladies and gentlemen. And coming in is Zach Ranky. Okay, Greg Vaughn, what do we got? I'm watching another at bat. I'm watching another one. Let's go. Do something good. Do something good. Okay, two balls, no strikes. Vaughn for MVP. I don't know about that. But he's been good today. Well, that was the pitch right there to send 450 feet, but we didn't do it. All right, two balls, one strike. Okay, good. Work a walk. Work a walk, man. Can give you Junis up on deck. Okay. Here we go. Here's the pitch. Full count. Grounded. It's going to get the run over to third. Two outs. I mean, a single then automatically gets that uh, gets Chase home, like guaranteed. I mean, two runs would be nice. Two runs would be very nice. Can we do it? Oh, that's hit deep, and it is gone. A two-run home run from Ken Griffey Jr. And we got a three-run lead. Okay, I'm confident now. I should be confident. But I've seen our pitching choke today. So, I don't know how confident I should be. But shout-out to Ken Griffey. 
110.8 off the bat. Ooh, that was beautiful. So now we got Vladimir Guerrero Jr. at the plate. He's going to take a ball low. I'll probably uh, watch this last at bat. And then we'll go back to the thing. Just because I want to... I want. I mean, we got two more... I'm going to do two more seasons. Most likely, since we're going to win this one. I'll probably just do two more. So I don't want to keep it... Keep you too long. Full count? I mean, not full count. What am I talking about? 3-0 pitch. 3-1. Here's the pitch. It's a uh, full count now. That was a ball. Should have probably not swung at that, but... And again, Vlamiger Jr. just swings at kind of everything up at there. So, not a surprise. Check swing. He did not go, so that is a walk. And we're going to go to quick manage here. Just to speed things up, we'll just see what happens. I mean, I'll hop on in for the final out, assuming we get it. So here comes Dedic Jita. He flies out. Okay, Rob Nen. Little pitching change. Who do we want to put in? Hunter Harvey. Pop up. Strike out. Can Hunter Harvey close it out for us against Lou? Oh, no, this is not Lou Gehrig. This is Duke Snyder. Can he do it? It's a ball. 98 miles per hour. Grounded foul. Let's see. Here's the pitch. Grounded foul. We got one more. One ball, two strikes. Grounded foul. Duke's not going to make it easy. Duke is not going to make it easy. Fly ball. Left field. Coming on is Vaughn. And that is the game. Let's go. We got the World Series. I thought we were going to lose it, but uh, we got it. 10 to 7 in game 7. The boys are happy as can be. And that's what we needed. We needed a World Series, and that is what we got. So let's go. Shout out to the guys. We're doing at least two more. We're doing two more seasons. So, okay. So we're going to take a look at the lineups and the awards. Jerry Harrison Jr., World Series MVP. Okay. Okay. Carlos Delgado, playoff MVP. Got the Jerry Harrison Jr., Carlos Delgado, Babe Ruth, Greg Vaughn. Love that. Uh, Jerry Harrison Jr. had one at bat, though. Wait a minute. He had one at bat. He was the World Series MVP. That doesn't make sense. Okay. That honestly that doesn't make any sense. Um uh, that's pretty well. Chase had that big hit. He didn't hit great in the postseason, but he had that big hit. Okay. I, I don't understand that. That I'm a little confused. Uh, the pitching was up and down, but you know, when we needed to we got the job done. Yeah, I don't know why Jerry Harrison won the MVP. He, with one at bat, that's not MVP worthy, but okay. San Diego Studios. For ya. All right, so um, obviously I want to make sure I keep some of these guys. Uh, I mean, the, most of these will just be, we'll let the CPU kind of just do those. Because I'm not really worried about these guys. I'm worried about getting the legends. So we all have money. Johnny Bench, Hunter Harvey, Christian Betancourt. We have a little bit of budget to work with here. And Bryce Harper, I mean, I'm trying to think who would be a great option for us. All right, I kind of want to add Vladimir Guerrero Jr., just because I, I I just feel like it'd be kind of cool to have uh, father and son on the same team, so we're gonna do that. Um, we'll go sixteen. We'll give him a little three-year deal, and that should hopefully get him. I, I mean, I just have to do that. I just it, I feel weird not doing that. Other than that, I mean, the free agency class isn't amazing. I think if we want anybody else here, Adam Dunn. 
Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. I mean, I guess we could use a right fielder. These are lineups. Oh, Vladimir Jr. What am I talking about? Why do I need a left fielder? It says third. I'm sorry, first baseman. Oh, yeah, so then Vladimir Guerrero. Be too bad. And then left field is uh, Greg Vaughn. Do we have a left field class? Luis Gonzalez? I'm going to throw him a contract. Why not? Um, yeah, we'll give him a little bit of, a little bit of money. Give him a little $10, $10 million a season. And cheese, and then give him 10 year. No, we'll give him, a, we'll give him an eight year. That should work. All right, yeah, we'll see what happens. Get these guys, and then on the next season. I right, do got Vladimir Guerrero Jr., so that's cool. All right, I grabbed Luis Gonzalez for the team as well. So welcome to Team Luis Gonzalez. And, I mean, that's it for me. I ran out of money. So let's head on to the uh, next season. All right, so here we are. And we're looking pretty good. Uh, Vladimir Guerrero. Derek Jeter, Babe Ruth, Luis Gonzalez, Ken Griffey Jr., Carlos Delgado, Adrian Meltzer, Johnny Bench, Chase Utley. We've got Vladimir Guerrero Jr. coming off the bench with Orlando Garcia, Mike Cameron, Greg Vaughn, Ian Kinsler. Sam Huff is on the squad as well. It's crazy. We look at the rotation. Ruth, Young, Palmer, Yamamoto, and Tanner. Cole, Schmoltz, Tyler Wells. Adrian Morejon. Or Morjon. Morjon? Uh, Rob Dunn, Carl Edward Jr., and then Mark Breyer. I mean, that this is the team. This is the team right here. I mean, I don't remember getting Taiwan Walker on my squad, but okay. Go off. I mean, I honestly, I don't want him. Who do I want, though? That's the question. I mean, there's just so much. I mean, yeah, he's got a bad contract relative to, like, the rest of the league. It's a pretty bad contract, but... Our team is good enough, so. Ooh, I got him tired, sorry. Didn't get a lot of sleep. All right. Let's head on to the uh, All-Star break. 57-41 at the All-Star break. I mean, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Um, Look at the league leaders. No, we'll look at the standings. 57 wins. One of the better teams in the MLB. Not the best, though. The Giants with 62-35, and 35, but... Nevertheless, we look at the lineups. They look pretty good, I'd say. Um, overall, nothing crazy. Beltre has been off this year. Uh, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., 10 260. Like father, like son. Yeah. Like father, like son. Very cool. Um, and yeah, I like it. I like the team. It's been pretty, it looks pretty good. Pitch rotation. Has been lackluster. Tanner has been awesome. The bullpen has been a little up and down. Mark Pryor, not a good season so far. Carl Edward Jr. is just, for some reason, just really good in the sim. Don't know why, but he just is. I mean, let's keep it up. I mean, there's really no need to make any moves. We're just going to keep simulating. I'm going to do another season after this. Third season, try to see if we can win back-to-back. -back. All right, well, we broke 100 wins. 161, four games over. Again, the winner of the wildcard playoff game is we won our division. We had the best record in the NL. And we ended up with the best record in the MLB. League leaders, Babe Ruth runs. That's all we had. There's Otani. He had 175 RBIs. I gotta get Otani on this team. Somehow, some way, I gotta get a trade for Shohei Otani. Don't think I can, but I'm gonna try. Uh it would just be amazing to have him on the team. But then where would he play, though? Because, like, you have Babe Ruth already. So, probably not worth it. Uh, the bench is really good. Pitch rotation. I mean, Ruth, Palmer. I, the ERA is pretty high. Even Tanner was awesome. Cole had a good year. Dude, Carl Edwards Jr. is just so good. I don't understand it. I don't understand why he's my best pitcher out of the bullpen, but he is. So shout out to him. Do we have any awards? I don't think we did. Maybe we did. Uh, no, I don't think we did. All right. Well, we're just gonna simulate and see what happens. So we had the Brewers, uh, Maddox. Anyone wins, by the way? 
We got Babe Ruth, and we win six to four. Game two, Palmer versus Negro. We lose nine to three. Yamamoto versus Burns. We lose four to three. We're gonna lose in four. We are. Did we blow this game? Hmm. 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 Well, that's unfortunate. Lineups. A little lackluster from some guys. Mainly uh, Babe Ruth and Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Also Ken Griffey Jr. Or not Vladimir Guerrero Jr., just Vladimir Guerrero. Bench didn't play. The pitching rotation wasn't stellar. Babe Ruth was solid. Jim Palmer sucks. Okay. Up and down. Up and down. All right. Well, let's see who wins the uh, World Series. We've got one more year. Mets beat the Astros. Let's head on to our fourth and final season. Try to see if we can win maybe two World Series in the video. All right. So, free and see, I mean, it's, the class isn't amazing. Um, I don't even know who I'd want to add. I kind of want to see if I can make a trade. I, I, I do want, I don't know. Part of me wants to show Hey Otani. I, I can't get him. And I could just do that straight up and I can get him. Hmm. That might not be terrible. Jim Palmer. What they want, Babe Ruth? Yeah, okay. Sure, Babe Ruth. They think you should be getting more back. Yeah, they want Babe Ruth. I don't think I can get him without having to give up like an actual good player. That's the only thing. It's like, I don't give a Carl Edwards Jr. either. Like, yeah, Babe Ruth they want straight up. Is that the only guy they want straight up? Uh, well, Johnny Bench, Derek Jeter, no. Well, they were close. Guerrero Jr., Babe Ruth, they'd want. Ken Griffey Jr., they'd want. I mean, it, it, they would take Utley. Okay, Greg Vaughn. I don't know if I want to go up Utley. If I did, if I did Yamamoto and Jim, yeah, no, they don't want Jim Palmer. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna get, I'm not gonna be able to get Otani. So that's fine. Breeding is anybody good? I mean, Nico Herner. I mean, if I really wanted to go with Chase Utley, I could get Nico Herner. <laughs> but uh, I don't know who I want to add. I guess Raleigh Fingers or Bumgarner. We could throw them contracts. Bumgarner wouldn't be too bad. He honestly doesn't even want that much money. So you would take a one-year deal. Yeah, I'll give you three million dollars for one year. Why not? Um, there's Mark Guire. That's the Yankees. Don't really care. John Smaltz. This John Smaltz. Yeah, I think we're good. I, I mean, I don't think we need to add anybody. Brian Wilson. We throw him like a little cheeky $7.7 .7 million if he wants to join. A little player option. That's about it. So we got Brian Wilson before the beard. And Madison Baumgartner with the beard. So a couple giants. All right, so the fourth and final season. This is the team we're rocking with right here looks good the bench looks good not gonna read every single name at this point you kind of can read but it, it's a good team you just gotta be able to perform in the postseason I mean, the rotation looks solid the bullpen looks elite they got garrett cole closing it out that's kind of funny i don't know if i'd have him closing it out but that's that's beside the point all right i mean it all comes down to this. Fourth and final season. Can we win another one or will we fail? Let's find out. 63 and 35 at the All Star break. We look at the lineups. And um, Vladimir Jr. is hitting amazing. I mean, he's only had 151 at bats, but he's doing well and he's in a limited amount of time. Greg Vaughn's here because uh, I guess Gonzalez is now coming off the bench. Delgado's here. He's also coming off the bench, too. So, I mean, I'm, I'm liking the team. Overall, not too bad. There's Mark McGuire. There's Mark McGuire. Different Mark McGuire. There's a few Mark McGuires, I believe. Shout out to the boys. 
Same thing with the pitching rotation. I mean, Jim Palmer's been amazing this year in the regular season. The bullpen overall, not too bad. Garrett Cole, 31 saves. Trade block. It's looking like that. Todd Helton's on there. He's doing pretty well. We're keeping the team as is. I mean, they're not going to need trades. Be the best record in the MLB right now? No, the Giants do by a half game because of Shohei Otani, most likely. We're trying to win another one, like I said. Will we succeed or will we fail? Let's find out. 97 and 65. Made as a wag our team, so not even winning the division. Um, I guess the Brewers 98 wins won the division. Giants in 99 wins. Cardinals, which was us, 97. Okay. Let's see the lineups. Guerrero Jr. was pretty good. Or Guerrero was good. Jared Jeter. Babe Ruth. There's Vladimir Guerrero Jr. He's really good. So overall, the lineup's not too bad. Greg Vaughn, a little iffy. We got Jerry Harrison Jr., World Series MVP. Um, probably undeservedly, but still. Carlos Delgado, not too bad. Ian Kinsler. And Mark McGuire stinks. <laughs> stinks. Okay. Pitching rotation. Babe Ruth, not great. Jim Palmer, great. Yamamoto, not great. Tanner, not, not amazing. Then we got Espino. We got Mark Pryor. We got a few guys. I mean, the pitching is not um, incredible. Carly Jr. is the GOAT. The GOAT relief pitcher. For some reason. Garrett Cole. All right, Cubbies, McClanahan versus Babe Ruth. Cubbies, by the way, 86 win team. We lose game one. Um, not good. Is our season over? Yes. Garrett Cole blew the game in the 10th inning. <sighs> of course. So we couldn't win more than one. We got one at least, so it's not a complete failure. But that is uh, a little upsetting that we could only get one. But it's just somehow it's luck of the draw. I mean, there are the stats. Jim Palmer pitched well. So can't complain about that. But all right, uh, let's uh, see who wins the World Series. Give you the Giants beating the Royals, uh, and that's it. That's it. That's all we got. Clayton Kershaw Hall of Famer. Let's close it out. All right, guys. Well, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment down below. Some more videos. There are socials. Play the second channel and main channel down below in the description. If you like other content from me, DJP. And that's it for me. With that being said, take care. See you all soon. Peace.